right here's paint I'm in the process of painting it this is gonna have orange white and black and that's the colors of this box with a big white stripe on the left side there alrighty all right here's painted I just finished painting it well now I need to build a handle for it and we'll paint the handle too check it out it's orange it's black and white and I'll put a handle on it tomorrow let this paint dry okie dokie later alrighty the boom box is finished I'll give you a size comparison. Here's the the Bose Sound Dock. See, mine is uh, bigger than it. Of course, it's homemade and it's got bigger speakers. And there's a Sound Link over there, which is really tiny. We'll give you tiny sound compared to this new boombox. I got the new Nano on there. This is awesome. Has 16 gigabytes. So all my music will fit on it. Literally all almost all my music can have been on it <laughs> Anyway, there's the the new one chrome and black as you can see there's Damage back there Because I had to cut the old battery out literally had to cut the back end and fit another piece of wood in there So I had to do that So I was thinking it would the battery would work. I should have tested it first, but oh well I cut the old battery out and uh, replaced with two smaller batteries. Now I've got to fix that. But nonetheless, it's finished. I'll put a how to video on there the next time. Anyway, see what y'all think about it later. Hey there, here's the boom box finished again. Now I had to replace the battery for a brand new battery. Well, if you can see in there, there's a 2.3 amp battery in there one 12 volt sealed lead acid 2.3 amp battery I got connected to the lapay which I soldered onto the lapay and I painted it again and there's a speaker sitting outside of the unit I want to give you an idea of what it looks like with like that and the back is fixed again. I had to take the whole back of the, cut the whole back of the box out, pull the old battery, which was a 3.3, would not fit through the front speaker hole, so I had to cut it out. I really just bashed it with a hammer and, and then cut out piece and um, installed another piece on there to fit it. And then puttied it to seal it off. And then painted it this time with a paintbrush which works better than spray paint anyways there it is I'm um put another video on here maybe to show the what it sounds like but you know it sounds pretty decent there's a four inch speakers right there Polk Audio later